guys, it's Kayla, and today I have a haul video for you guys. This is stuff that I kind of collected over the past two weeks, I would say. I did some online purchases, and I also went to Target probably five times in this collective haul. I know I go to Target every single day, basically, if you watch my vlogs, then you would know that. The first thing I got was an online purchase. I do order stuff from Jewel Mint. I have a monthly subscription to that site, and I really like their jewelry pieces. They're nice quality, and it's really affordable stuff. You can just sign up for Jewel Mint. It's free to make an account, but of course you have to pay whenever you want to get something sent to you. So, the first thing I got this time, this was in my April showroom. It's just a little cuff. I don't know what they actually call this on the site but it's one of those I don't know springy kind of cuffs that just goes on your arm it's silver I technically focus more on gold accessories when I go out and buy stuff but this is just a change for me and I'll wear it on this arm simply because my watch usually goes on this side that's the first thing I picked out from my April showroom and I do have a coupon code for you guys if you guys want to save some money on your purchase with Jewel Mint you can check out the link down below and the code will be written in the description bar for you this is the second thing I purchased this month and they have some really cute bracelets. I'm really into bracelets and layering up stuff on this arm in particular because I like that whole vibe. For summertime, it's just a thing that I always do. I have a set like this already, but they're in different colors, and basically these are like those friendship bracelets that you would make in summertime at camp or something. They're all so cute, and they'll look really great with my friendship bracelet on this arm mixed in with my watch and all that fun stuff, so this was just the second thing that I picked up. Oh, I should probably focus in on this. Here they are up close if you guys want to see what they look like. I love the colors of these. Definitely check out Jewel Mint for cute little bracelets and stuff like that for summer. The next two things I got that are accessory pieces are, well jewelry I should say, are from Brandy Melville. And this one you actually saw on my Instagram. It's just a bunch of skulls. I freaking love this. It's such an edgy piece. I had to have it when I saw it online. And I also picked up this little skull ring. I have yet to take it out of the packaging because I did not want to lose it for this video. It's just two little skull heads. As you can see, it's a skull of a ring very simple and basic for an everyday piece. While I was on the site looking at stuff to buy, of course I had to get more clothes. I love clothes and I think this time of my life I'm trying to focus more on buying clothes for my wardrobe instead of tons of like makeup products because I don't need that much makeup in my life. But clothes, you can never go without too many. So this first top is just your basic light summer knit material. It's a cream color. Very, very simple and easy to style. It has long sleeves on it but it's more cropped in the front so I really like this shirt for like an everyday kind of basic the next top I got was probably one of my favorites it's a tank top with big open sleeves on the side it's a skull I don't know what it is with me and skulls lately and the thing is like I like this because it has the like American flag imprint on its face for some reason I've been buying a lot of stuff that are so like patriotic esque so that's why I picked this guy up and this is gonna be really cute with a bandeau layered underneath of it and I got this little hoodie as well it's really thin so in my eyes it's more like a zip-up shirt and I would just pair this with a black leather jacket over top of it and just wear it with like jeans. Then I got this cardigan. It's a super long cardigan so I don't know how well it's going to pick up in the screen. I'm sorry you won't be able to see these pieces very well but hopefully I'll be able to style them in outfits of the weeks and stuff like that. So it's just your basic knit cardigan. Very lightweight, super thin material. You can throw this over anything and it will look really really nice. And the last thing I got was another patriotic kind of thing. Again I told you I'm so obsessed with like patriotic stuff this season. And it's basically just a flag scarf. So you have the stars and the stripes and they never end. So I got this just to pair with basic tops, stuff like that. I think this would look really cute with that cream shirt that I just showed you guys. So all this stuff I need to wash because it smells like a warehouse. I'm not feeling it. That's the stuff I got from Brandy Melville. And then I went to Target and got some clothing accessories. I got this black belt just to wear with jeans. It has like a gold little buckle here very simple and basic and then I got this fedora I don't technically ever wear hats so I figured it would be a perfect time for me to go ahead and experiment with them and this was on sale for nine dollars it has this really cute little bow on the side I just see myself wearing this on vacation in California walking down Santa Monica Pier or something so I just picked that up for summer and then I got two pairs of shoes because I needed new sandals my Vera wearing flats 
or sandals were just raggedy. I had to replace those. So I saw these and they were on sale. Well, they weren't even on sale. They were just $15. And they're so cute, very basic and easy to wear with jeans or dresses and skirts. So I got those in brown and I also picked them up in white. So two basic colors that I can wear with anything and everything. I picked up two tanning oils at Target. These are both by Banana Boat. They're the same product, but I guess in different forms. One's an aerosol can and one is just a spritzer bottle. And this is a deep tanning oil with SPF of four. I do not wear tanning oil when I'm out on the beach, okay? I wear this if I'm outside on my back porch and there's little sun and I need some help. So this is what I wear when I do not go to the beach because I think it's too much if you wear oil on the beach but I just got those they were on sale and then I got an all-over sunscreen with SPF 30 it's an aerosol can I can keep this in my purse if I feel like I'm going outside for too long and I don't have anything on for protection I'll have that with me and then I picked up the Neutrogena what is this liquid lotion sunblock with SPF 55 I slap on the sunscreen on my face I do not want my face to get super dark because I have to buy new foundations I do not want it to burn because burns are not cute they're not comfortable so I definitely use a lot of sunscreen on my face when it comes to summertime so I got that then I got some nail polishes I went to Sally's Beauty Supply and I went to Ulta I kind of got nail polish happy I saw sale 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 and I went crazy so at Sally's I got six bottles of nail polish of China Glaze for $20 first of all they were buy two get one free and then I used my beauty card and got a dollar off of each bottle so that was a bar just to keep it very simple, I picked up another of my favorite top coat by China Glaze. Since it was on sale, I figured you might as well just get it now, and this is the Fast Forward Top Coat. It dries super quick, and I absolutely love this. And for the five colors that I picked up on that sale, the first one is this red polish. It's called Salsa. Salsa. Yeah, I like the food. And it's just a red. This is so freaking pretty. It's a neon shade by Chana Glaze. It's called Rose Among Thorns, I think. And I know neons, in my experience with having them, they can be a little bit streaky, so you need to paint them on like two coats, maybe even three, and then have a really good top coat over top. So this is such a bright color. The camera is not doing its justice. So I really can't wait to use that. And then I got two colors that might look fairly similar. Actually, no, they don't. This one here is another neon. It's called In the Limelight. Four Leaf Clover and In the Limelight. You can see the differences of those two colors. This one is Secret Periwinkle by China Glaze, and it's nothing more than just your basic periwinkle shade. The last two colors I got, this last one is a China Glaze color, and this is Sunshine Pop. Obviously, I have it on my nails right now, and I love this color so, so much. It's so fun for summer. I think yellow polishes are so different, and just, I love them a lot. And then I got a new bottle of my OPI's Do You Lilac it because my other bottle is pretty much empty. I used it so much that you can barely get polish on the brush when you take it out of the thing, so I just had to replace it. I think that's everything I have to show you guys today. I'm sorry this was such a long video. I do apologize for that, but make sure you guys check out the down bar for any information on what I'm wearing. I have a hair tutorial on this look. If you want to see it, I'll link it down below for you guys, and if you have any questions for me, then let me know down below, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye, guys!